Hello everyone, welcome to Pande Guruji YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to continue the SQL practice set of uh, uh, practice set 5. So, I already uploaded the uh, practice set uh, 1 to 4. So, if you didn't get a chance, uh, then you can please go and uh, uh, watch all this uh, uh, important SQL interview question uh, which I uploaded under the uh, playlist uh, you can find here the uh, SQL interview question and answer uh, become champ in the SQL or also you can find here the SQL practice exercise will the solution so uh, if you have any question if you have uh, any query and uh, if you attend any interview and if you not able to solve it you can put the question on the uh, comment box so I will definitely uh, reply to you okay so please if you not uh, subscribe my channel please go ahead and subscribe and uh, please uh, at least like the uh, video to uh, motivate me and if you want to uh, learn the complete practice set okay so I already prepared so you can download all these practices set from the uh, video description and uh, uh, you can do the practices so all this uh, uh, set we have the question with the uh, answer based on the real time in important interview question so let's start with the today uh, topic so today i will discuss again uh, next five question uh, which is totally based on the uh, real time scenario only okay so if you uh, just you can go and uh, uh, find the all the question and try to solve by self you can find all this question from the from the video description and try to solve first if you're not able to solve it then you can see how we can i solve it so the first question is the uh, find the maximum uh, minimum and the average tax amount for internet sales okay so if for the internet sales you need to find the maximum you need to find the minimum and the uh, average tax amount for the internet sale and you can use the effect internet sales table the second question is the uh, find the maximum and minimum unit price on each order date okay so for each order date what is the maximum and what is the minimum unit price you need to use the fact internet sales table uh, which is the available uh, on the real time database the third question is the uh, find the average yearly income of the English education high school okay so we have the English education high school so you need to figure out what is the average yearly income uh, next question is the how many how many total issues were raised during the holiday so uh, we have the fact call center table where you can uh, need to be uh, find out the how many total issue are raised during the holiday only and the last question is write a query to uh, list all object name and the type okay so uh, this is the very common interview question how we can uh, query all the object available into the database and uh, how many store procedures created so I will discuss in the detail all this question so let's uh, jump to the SQL Server uh, Management Studio and uh, see how to solve all this question one by one. So the first question is the find the maximum, minimum and average tax amount for the internet sales. So I use the fact internet sales table here. So for finding the maximum value, uh, we have the SQL inbuilt function that is the max. Uh, so this is the column Elias name okay and they basically asking for the average tax amount so you need to be used the tax amount okay so if you look up this uh, fact internet sales table we have the tax amount column and uh, for the minimum we need to use the min uh, min tax amount and the average we need to be used the average tax amount so uh, now if you execute it okay now if you execute it uh, you can see you will get the maximum minimum and the average tax amount for the fact internet sales table now the second question is the find the maximum and minimum unit price on each order date so we have the order date so 
so based on this uh, question you can see each order date okay so if you uh, look up the fact internet sales table here okay so I'm opening into the second window like select star from select star from fact internet sale so we we have this uh, unit price okay so unit price they are asking unit price and order date okay so just you can put the unit price in the front and also order date okay so if you put the order date so they asking for the each order date so from one date how what is the unit price okay so basically uh, you need to be consider here the grouping okay so you need to be use the uh, group by clause but you can see the quotient they not mention you need to be use the group by clause or something but based on the question only you need to be understand what uh, group by you uh, what function we need to be use here okay so uh, basically I use the select order date uh, max unit price so ba basically they asking maximum and uh, minimum for each date so maximum price by date uh, so uh, maximum you can use the max for the minimum you can use the mean so if you execute uh, this one you will get the max unit price okay so this is the max unit price if you want the minimum unit price same you can use the uh, same uh, uh, same uh, function you need to use that is the for the uh, minimum okay so uh, just you can use here the minimum unit price so just you can put here the comma and in place of the max you need to be use the mean and you need to change the column name else also minimum unit price by date so when once you use the group by clause so this is the for each date uh, this is the maximum unit price and this is the minimum unit price so to solve it, this type of the question you need to be un understand the question first okay then you are able to solve this type of the question now we have the next question is the uh, find the average yearly income of the English education high school so what is the average yearly income of the high school so you need to use the average function here and uh, group by clause English education because they are asking only for the uh, English education that is the high school so you need to be use the having clause so I already discussed in the detail uh, in the building function so if just you can go and watch all the building function to solve all this type of the question now the next question is the how many total issue uh, were raised in the holiday you need to use the fact internet cell so we have the uh, wage type and wage type is equal to holiday so some we need to be used here so total issue raised in the holiday is the 58 here if you not use the having they will give the for the all okay holiday and the weekday so if they ask the question how many days in the weekday yes you can hard code it the weekday is 104 okay so like this uh, you can use the last question is the right query to list all the object name and the type so basically in the uh, SQL server we have the uh, different type of the object like the table like the store procedure like the trigger like the function so how you can find out all the list so just you can use the select distinct type this description and type from sys object so you will get all the object name here okay that is the uh, what is the type is there so basically if you require the foreign key is the app uh, internal tab, it uh, it so for the same thing suppose if you require the uh, a user table so user table the u okay so what you need to do you need to put put this select star from sys object so uh, if you put this select star from sys object where where if you put the type type is equal to type is equal to if you put the u you will get all the user table here okay so u is the user table so you will get all the table available into the database so this is the uh, so you, you need to be put this select star from select star from sys object where type is equal to u so you will get all the table which is available into this database so you can see total 53 user defined table is created in the database 
so same like if you required to find out the how many foreign key uh, for foreign key you need to be put f and the for internal table it for unique key u key so like this this query is very important that is the reason uh, very frequently uh, asking into the interview so if you practice this type of the question uh, and if you after the practicing this type of the question if you are going to attend this any type of the interview uh, you definitely crack all the type of the interview and if you have any question if you have any doubt and if you want any uh, help from me just you can put the comment under the video and uh, so i will definitely help you out so uh, keep learning and uh, keep watching thank you so much